Thank you. Kindly sit down. I'd like to begin by just uh, giving you a message from us. Taus puso akong nakikiramay sa mga nasawi sa kamay ng kalaban. Let me assure the brief that the valiant sacrifices of your loved ones will not be in vain. Your government will ensure that your needs will be taken care of. That is my commitment to you. Secretary Delfin Lorenzana, General Eduardo Año, Lieutenant General Donato San Juan, Mayor Mauricio Dumugan, the Foreign Service Attaches, the officials, faculty members, and staff of the Philippine Military Academy, PMA Selaknib Class of 2017, and to their parents to whom this moment rightfully belong, the Cadet Corps of the Armed Forces of the Philippines, fellow workers in government, my beloved countrymen. Today may we make history. This is not this is the first time that the female cadets occupied eight of the top ten top, uh, top spots in their graduating class. With the highest number of graduating women in PMA's history, this breakthrough is a fitting tribute to our mothers, sisters, daughters as we celebrate Women's Month. To the Selaknib class of 2017, may you always stay true to your class name and defend the motherland with all your honor and might. I have no doubt that you will do this because you are the cream of the crop. You belong to the batch who have successfully hurdled the rigors of the PMA from all over 22,000 applicants. I know that many of our graduating cadets have had mixed emotions for the past few days. It must be difficult to contain the excitement and jubilation as well as the expectations and apprehensions that graduation brings. But we need to acknowledge your overwhelming feeling for they remind you of the life that you have to leave behind and at the same time, they transport you to a new world of service to the nation. The training and education that you have gone through in this academy are just part and parcel of the kind of soldier that all of you will become. You have been trained and molded like all, all other cavaliers, but your true self will make the officer, soldier, and leader in you. You no longer carry the identities that you once possessed before you entered the academy. Instead, you have been molded to become leaders, officers, and men, and women of character. May the values of learning imparted to you during your years in the academy be engraved in your hearts, and may this guide you wherever life leads you. Of there is the challenge will not just require your intellectual or physical capabilities, but your sound moral judgment as well. I am, um, I apologize, ma'am. It was not done. Commander, uh, could you give the tea, Kaspahinga? Okay, bigay ng tea, Kaspahinga. Kaspahinga! Ah! Ang nagsulat, ma'am, dito, hindi ka sinali. <laughs> Bugbugin na lang natin. I'd like to apologize and acknowledge the presence of the beautiful lady, the Vice President of uh, the Republic of the <laughs> Sorry, Mama. No, wala na ang kutuloy, Mama. It is not only your enemies, but the entire world that will, be, that will test, tempt, corrupt, and pressure you. 
But as long as your hearts and minds remain in the right place, whom you have pledged to serve, remember your roots and remember the people. Be vanguards of hopes, be catalysts of change. At this point, I'd like to personally thank all Filipino soldiers for your loyalty to the Philippine flag, to those who risk their life and limb to defend this country's sovereignty, as well as those who continue to offer their sweat and blood to fortify the pillars of a great nation that we are presently trying to build. Rest assured that the government will reciprocate your valor and unwavering courage by providing you with all the necessary support and incentives. This administration will give you and your families the services, benefits, and entitlements that you, that you rightfully deserve. You will be provided with the proper equipment and the weapons, particularly body armors, helmets, and rifles, as well as short firearms so that you can, can defend yourselves even when you are off duty. In the next two to three years, the AFP will fight, will, will have simulators, flight, radars, support patrol and assault vehicles, as well as new surveillance and fighter aircraft so that you can better patrol our borders and guide our seas. All of this we do so that our AFP will be more effective in pursuing its mandate in assisting law enforcement agencies in battling crime and illegal drugs and in undertaking relief and rescue efforts during disasters and calamities. With our people's continued support, we will have an AFP that we can truly be proud of, an AFP that will be at par with the rest of the world. Therefore, to the Sanaktib class of 2017, and to the men and women of the AFP, I say this to you. Proceed with your heads held high, knowing that the government and the Filipino people are with you in every step all the way. Powered by strong convictions and unshakable faith in the Filipino, let us overcome the challenges that lie ahead and usher in a great future for our nation. Long live the armed forces of the Philippines. Long live our strong, beloved republic. Thank you. This will be the first time. I, 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 I remember signing a document of, of pardon. <laughs> Pero ito, pardon ng, pardon of, may read it. Gusto niyo makinig? Ayaw ninyo, uwi na lang tayo. It's a Malacanian Palace, Manila. Pardon of punishment. In observance to the time-honored rule tradition of the Philippine Military Academy on the occasion of the graduating class of PMA Salaknib, class 2017, I, your strolly, Commander-in-Chief of the Armed Forces of the Philippines, hereby pardon all your outstanding punishments to the Cadet Corps, Armed Forces of the Philippines, as recommended by the Superintendent PMA, effective today. Pirmahan ko na. Bukas na lang siguro. <laughs> okay. Bawi yun, bawi. Just be true to your oath of office. Do not pledge loyalty to, to, a, to a, a person, a human being. It's always to the flag and to the Constitution. Uh, yan ang advice ko, sir. Never propagate or nurture loyalty to a a government worker also like you. We are on the same boat. We work for the Filipino. And I sign. <laughs> uh, 
Gak ada ya nah Oke nah Ini memang gak terasa Melegaya kayo no Melegaya kayo nanti Oh lagi Dagang maksalah Tak <laughs>